Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. All right, let's check it out. Uh, looks like this evening we'll be around 90 for a little while, but dropping back through the upper 80s here at 7 o'clock with 81 at 9 p.m. Humidity levels at least aren't too bad. And at 11 o'clock, generally clear skies and 77 degrees. And let's take a look at that forecast. Tomorrow morning, 74 at 8. We expect to see a partly to mostly sunny sky throughout the day and maybe just a few more scattered clouds, especially later in the afternoon. And with the humidity levels up, it looks like heat index numbers tomorrow afternoon could be up into the middle 90s. Weather headlines tonight. We do have an air pollution advisory in effect uh, this evening. Last check, the air quality index was at 133 out at Eastwood and hot and humid conditions Wednesday. Heat index numbers into the 90s and that looks like big relief from the mugginess comes our way Friday and also into the weekend as we get back in on some cooler and less humid air. We still have that air pollution advisory. Greenville, Troy, Springfield, Dayton, Middletown down to Cincinnati for this evening. As far as the mugginess goes, well, we're going to see dew points climb back up around 70, low 70s Wednesday and Thursday. But check out the relief by the end of the week. Those numbers dropping back to the 60s Friday, upper 50s Saturday and Sunday, and that'll make for some pleasant conditions this weekend. You might notice a little more haziness in the air today. Well, some of that smoke's been drifting in from the northwest, and the NASA smoke model actually showing some of that uh, thicker smoke drifting down our way as we get into Wednesday and also into Thursday. So we may notice a little bit more of that. And as far as the forecast goes for Tokyo on Wednesday, highs will be upper 80s to near 90. Scattered showers and thunderstorms. They're still dealing with a tropical storm that will be moving inland across uh, Japan here as we go through the next 24 hours. Right now that tropical storm top winds at 45 miles per hour moving to the north but expecting more of a northwest trek mostly to the north of Tokyo. And low temperatures tonight you can see dropping down into the mid to upper 60s over the northern Miami Valley and generally uh, mid to upper 60s to near 70 in the southern part of our region. And then high temperatures tomorrow afternoon should climb into the upper 80s to right around 90 degrees or so in Troy, about 90 in Dayton and over toward Xenia. And then we'll see some of those showers and thunderstorms move into the area on Thursday. A little bit of a cooling trend. Notice only about 83 Salina, Wapakoneta, and then the upper 80s down here in the southern part of the Miami Valley. Maybe close to 90 just depending on the timing of the thunderstorms that will develop on that day. But we don't have to worry about any of that rain right now. Live Doppler 2 HD is dry. High pressure from Illinois to Pennsylvania, keeping things pretty quiet out there, at least for the time being. 87, our current temperature. We have a calm wind. Heat index number at 86 with a low relative humidity today. 82 in Urbana, 86 Wapakoneta, but 89 in Minster and Troy for a couple of the warmest numbers. And our future track forecast map keeps things mostly clear tonight, just a few passing clouds. And we should see partly to mostly sunny conditions tomorrow. But then finally, as we get to Thursday, some showers and thunderstorms rolling in. Could even see a few of those as we go into a Wednesday night and Thursday morning. Mostly clear, a little muggier tonight. Overnight lows, upper 60s to about 70. Partly to mostly sunny, a hot, humid day tomorrow as we climb up to 90 degrees in the afternoon. 87 on Thursday with showers and thunderstorms. Only 72 for a low temperature in the morning, but check out the pleasant weather. Friday's high temperature 82, turning less humid, partly sunny and partly cloudy over the weekend. Low temperatures near 60. 60, highs around 80 or the low 80s, and we even drop back to highs in the 70s with lows in the 50s Monday and Tuesday.